Want to be the proud owner of your very own base set Charizard? Well, all you have to do is like this video, comment, and subscribe, and you will be entered to win. And every single video in April is a chance to win, and the winner will be chosen on May 1st. Hi guys, Pokey Sisters here. This is Katie, and today we have the newly released um, I guess I'm going to call this a lunchbox tin because, you know, that just sounds like a good name. So, let's just get right on into this here. Um, I don't have scissors, so hopefully, um, I can get into this. Alright, there we go. Uh, let's get into this. I really, really like these products. They're always a blast to open. So, let's get this open and see what comes in. I guess first we can do a little, uh, 360 of the tins. Here's the front. Have Lunala on the side and Solgaleo on that side. Have the energy. And then we have the three Alola starters. We have Rowlet, Litten, and Poplio right there. That just looks adorable. I love it. And we kind of knocked Mudkip up, kept over. We're going to move him over to the side for now. And let's get into this. Alright, so right off the bat, I see our three promos here. And this really awesome looking coin. One that I actually don't have yet, so... That's always nice to get a coin. I don't have. Really love that. It is adorable. So let's get into these promos. I'm going to do my best to get these out <laughs> without damaging them. It's just the way they package you sometimes. Um, just, just look at that. Poor Rowlet got just destroyed. But I just love these promos. They're so adorable. So let's leave this one up here. There we go. Love the artwork on these. So now, let's see, it looks like Poplio, uh, I really don't want to damage these, but they're just, yep, it's just kind of impossible not to, I mean, just look at that, ugh, oh, they're so cute, I don't want them damaged, but look at that Poplio, he's adorable. Sleeve that up right there, and then I'll try to get Litten out. That one actually looks pretty okay. Um, it's still definitely not mint, it's pretty warped, but other than that, it looks pretty good. So, there is our Litten, and my question for you guys today is going to be, which of these three promos do you like the best? Um, from watching other people's videos, I really like the Rowlet, but seeing them in person, I've got to go with Pop Leo, I don't know. Something about that card, I love it in person, so. Mudkip, you can hold those three cards over there, even though you guys can't completely see it. You know, we'll set this off to the side. Um, okay. Let's see here. Oh, I also forgot there was a code card in here. I'm sure it unlocks the promos and maybe the coin. And here are our booster packs. We have two Sun and Moon, two Steam Siege, and a Fates Clyde. Interesting sets that they gave us there. Um, here are our pencils. They have the three starters on them. Look pretty nice. So there's those. Um, we have some stickers, which... They're giving me some troubles. Alright, there. We just popped that whole thing out. That works out good, actually. So, here are the three starters, three big stickers, and we have the two legendaries, Lunala and Solgaleo. Those look really nice as well. We have a little mini binder here. Gonna store some cards in there. And probably one of my favorite things that comes in this is the pad of paper. I always find use for that when I'm writing notes and stuff for trades and sales. So there is what is in that lunchbox tent. I guess we can leave it there in the background. I um, might have to zoom out just a tad. There we go. Alrighty, finally, let's get into some packs. Let's see, we'll start with, we're gonna put them in that order because yeah, we'll start with Lunala. My goal is to pull an ultra rare. I think that's a doable out of five packs, but we shall see. Let's see, this is Sun and Moon, so we're gonna go four and two. All right. We've got a Drowsy, Crab Roller, Sand Isle, Alolan Meowth, Pick a Peck, a Fighting Energy, Great Ball, Passimian, a Team Skull Grunt, a Reverse is a Switch, and we have a Parasect Regular Rare. So nothing too great out of that first pack, but maybe we could find a Professor Sycamore in Steam Siege. Kind of weird they didn't give us evolutions in this, but hey, I, I like that they're mixing the sets up. It's kind of nice. So set that code card off to the side and go three and two. All right. 
We've got a Quancher, Nidoran Mail, Chimchar, Nosepass, Litwick. Hey, we got our captivating Pokepuff if you guys are new. This card holds a special place in Sarah and my heart, so we're gonna set that in the background. We have a shiny Zumaril, Fletchender, a reverse rare Ampharos, that's always nice to find a reverse rare, and a Gastrodon regular rare. All right, so, so far we have a Pokepuff and an Ampharos. This card isn't really that good, but it's just special to Sarah and I. So uh, let's move on into Fates Collide. Um, I would have liked to seen Fates Collide replaced with Maybe Breakpoint or Evolutions, because Fates Clyde isn't my most favorite set in the world. Although there are some pretty cool cards in the set, so hopefully we can find something here. We've got a Bronzor, Minchino, Deerling, Carbink, Fennekin, Wormadam, Pokemon Fan Club, Autono Spirit Link, a reverse is a Scorched Earth. I don't know if that card's still playable, it used to be. Um, and an X Plowed, so. Huh, we're not looking too good, so come on, Steam Siege, we need to find something good out of you. But surprisingly enough, so Steam Siege is the only card that's given us anything notable yet, so maybe it can just keep on being good to us. Set this code card off to the side and go three and two. Alright, we've got a Meowth, Hopip, Litwick, ah, we skipped a Mareep, Krogunk, Pokemon Ranger, Hey, Pom, need a Reno. Ooh, we got a Reverse Volcanion. That's actually a pretty good card. And we have an Amoongus. So, Steam Siege has given us two Reverse Rares, and that's about it so far. I'm gonna scoot that. There we go. Okay. Final pack. We haven't even pulled a Hollow yet. So, worst case scenario, we need to get a Hollow out of here to at least make things a little bit better. So, I'm gonna give you guys this code card. Hopefully it will bring us good luck because right now we are needing it. We are not looking too hot. So we'll go four and two. All right. In our final pack, we have a Fomantis, a Lolan Grimer, Togedemaru, Steffel, Marini, a Metal Energy, Pelipper, an Ultra Ball. Come on, can we find the Secret Rare Ultra Ball? Can I get some Secret Rare Ultra Ball hype in the comments? Hopefully we can find it. Uh, Corsola. Our reverse is just a common Fomantis, and um, definitely not a Secret Rare Ultra Ball, it is a Beware. Shout out to the Beware GX box that's coming, but not shout out to this product, because we really didn't find anything all too great. I mean, if you think about it, five packs, you would expect at least one Hollow, but um, we found two reverse rares. Albeit the, the Volcanion is actually a pretty good one to get. I pull that Ampharos Hollow all the time, but... Dang, I mean, not not the best of pulls there. So hopefully you guys still enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you leave it a big thumbs up, click that subscribe button, and of course, go out and catch them all.